Uh, guys, just giving you a bit of an update on my hanging on Spitfire. <clears throat> I've had this thing for many months now, and uh, I used to build a plane and get it in the air within a week because I was so damn impatient. But um, I've been too busy of late, and I've sort of got back into other interests besides this uh, hobby, so it's kept me away a bit. And um, I'm hoping that within the next three weeks I'll have this thing ready to go because it's so close to, to being airborne anyway. The only thing I have to do really is just do a little bit of work on the cockpit. Just got to glue the little backrest in, the pilot, and the canopy. Just got to put that on. Um, I've got one more, what do you call them, sock if you like, to put on um, the, uh, the landing gear. And I've got to put the battery in for the retract, and just with the uh, with the cowl, I just need to adjust some of the holes because some of them, the the, the uh, tubes and things aren't quite centered, and I'm a bit worried about like the the exhaust um, the exhaust line sort of cutting itself on that hole. So I just got to hone those out a little bit and run the engine in. That's all I have to do, um, and then. It's airborne. It's been like that for, oh, I don't know, three months, I think, maybe longer. <clears throat> I've lost track of time. I've been so busy. But uh, I'm aiming to get this thing ready and in the air within three weeks, hopefully. Um, the weather's coming good. We're going into our summer now. It's damn windy all the time at the moment, but it's bound to get better. And uh, so I'm looking forward to getting this thing in the air. So... Just uh, if you're wondering whatever happened to it, because I did post videos of it before, um, it's still around. I just hadn't finished it. So there you go. It'll be airborne soon. Cheers.